What is up guys, Digital Player HD here and I'm back again with a Tom Notch GD Fire Online video and in today's video I'm going to show off all of the clothing glitches that are working after patch 1.28 so I hope you guys enjoyed the video, we would appreciate it if you drop a like and a comment of some feedback on this video uh, I'm not going to be showing all of the clothing glitches because I have uh, went over two of the really cool ones with the bandana and hat uh, mask so there will be a link in the description or on screen right now if you want to go and check out that video. So if you're watching this like probably a month uh, after it was released, it's more likely going to be patched. So hope you guys enjoyed the video. Right guys, on to the very first glitch and this is called the Soul Machine glitch. So this is a really awesome and easy uh, method to get a mask on with the helmet or glasses if you want. So first off, you want to have a saved outfit that you want to have a glitch with. Then you want to have another outfit that you want the mask or glasses or hat with to be glitched onto the other outfit. So once you have that, you want to make your way over to any sort of machine located around the map. I don't want to wear the outfit or just put on the mask or helmet or glasses that you want to glitch. So you want to go over to the sewing machine and you obviously want to purchase the soda. And as soon as you pick up the soda and cracks the top, you want to open your interaction menu and then change to the outfit that you have saved and you want the glitch to work with. And as you see from the outcome, it can make some outfits look pretty damn awesome. As you see right now, I've put the uh, gas mask on with the helmet and the heavy combat. So this uh, glitch does not work on 360 I have heard, only on the next gen, but for the next glitch and I am low on battery so that sucks so I'll have to change it. Uh, so on to the second glitch, this glitch will work on the 360 and on Xbox One that I've been told by a couple of friends. So moving on to the second glitch which is the telescope one. Right guys, on to the second glitch and this is obviously the telescope glitch. So I've heard that this does work on 360, I may be wrong but I have been told this by a couple of friends. Uh, so first off you want the high end department with the telescope and then you want to have the outfit that you want and you want to put on the mask first that you want for the outfit. So once you have that on, you want to go out to your phone, go on a quick jobs and go play random. Then you want to quickly pick up your phone and then start up any mission for like Trevor and Martin and as you do that you want to hit right on the d-pad so you look into the telescope so this might take like 40 to 30 seconds to load into the mission so I'll probably just speed it up if it takes long alright guys once you are in the mission and as you see the background is like where we are around the circle for a telescope you simply want to back out And I see that you're in a weird like camera angle right now. Uh, you just want to don't move, go to your action menu, go to your inventory accessories, and you want to put on the helmet and everything you want on. So I'll just quickly put on a helmet, just black helmet. Uh, you put glasses on as well, so I'll have that. Then once you have that, you just want to exit telescope. And now, as you see, I look very dodgy, but this is, I'm not keeping this outfit. But it's really easy. So you can wear a mask, glasses, and helmet with your outfit. So moving on to the uh, third glitch. Right guys, for the third glitch, this glitch is going to be how to wear any scarf with the heist hoodies. So I don't know why I can't wear the scarf with the heist hoodie in the first place, because it makes the outfit look more shady if you're going for the sneaky or just a robber type of look so first off you want to put any of the heist hoodies on then you want to put on a mask so your hood goes up any mask will do but for some reason as you put your mask up and your hood goes up you can just put a scarf on as you see I was going to hire a black one on so as you see it makes the outfit look much better because you can hide the neck you can take the mask off as well, so you don't need that exact mask on. 
So you need to have it like that. Or you can have any of these masks on. Let's go take that off. So it gives the outfit a bit more bulk. So we're on to the fourth glitch. Alright guys, for the fourth glitch is how they wear your hood up with the heist uh, hoodies without any masks. So this is also going to use their uh, department again with telescopes, so obviously you need a high end apartment. First off, if you want to have one of the heist hoodies on, then you want to go into your inventory or accessories and you want to put on the night vision so your hood goes up. Then you want to go into your phone, go into random and go into one of the adversary modes. Uh, you want to click, click yes, and then as you do that, you want to hit right on the D-pad. So you go to the telescope. So yeah, again, this might take 30 to 40 seconds to load up. And this one also is more time consuming because there's not a lot of people who play uh, adversary modes on GTA and more, more likely playing heist to get money. So I'll speed up until I actually get into a mission with people. Right guys, now we are actually in the mission. I forgot to say this may take more than one try to actually get into the adversary mode. But once you're in the screen, you simply want to back out. Then what this will do, this will have your hood up, but they would have took off the night vision. Right guys, as you now see, I've just spawned down and the night vision is gone and I have my hood up. So this is a really awesome glitch if, if these glitches helped you out with any outfit ideas or with any outfits that you wanted to make, but couldn't make them due to the uh, Rockstar restrictions. We much appreciate if you could drop a like. Uh, follow me on Twitter, like my Facebook page, and my website. All links will be in the description and also on the homepage of my YouTube channel. So thanks for watching guys. Have a great day. Peace.